All right, in this video, we're going to take a look at constructing a regular hexagon inscribed in a circle. Now, let's talk through what's going on here. Let's, let's talk through what a regular hexagon is. So remember, hexagon has six sides, and regular means that it has all equal sides and all equal angles, because anybody could take a circle and just throw six points on there and then make themselves an inscribed hexagon, right? That's not particularly impressive. What we want to do is make one that has equal sides and equal angles. And uh, to be honest, this is one of my favorite constructions. I think it's just kind of a lot of fun. So here's what we're going to do. Okay, and remember, inscribed means that each of the vertexes of the hexagon are going to be, each of the angles here are going to be on the circle. So, um, so we're going to use our compass and our straight edge. And so our compass, what we're going to do is we're going to pick any point on the circle, doesn't matter. We're going to stretch a circle out to the center of the circle. So notice we get some intersecting points here. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a mark here on my circle and here on my circle. Okay. Now, you really only have to make one of them. I think it's just a little bit faster if you make two. So I, I've made these two. And all we're going to do is we're going to pick up this compass, and we're just going to drag it to the next spot. So notice what happens. I picked it up. I drag it to the next spot. Okay. And I'm going to make this mark here. And I'm going to make this mark here. Okay. And I'm just going to keep picking it up, moving it to the next mark. Okay. And actually, in this case, I really didn't need that one because I'm going to need to go back here. And there we go. Okay, and notice we just get these marks the whole way around. All right, and then what we're going to use is we're going to use six blue line segments to make our hexagon. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six. And we take a look. Does it have six sides? Thumbs up. Does it look like the angles are congruent and the sides are congruent? That looks good too. And that's what our construction of a regular hexagon inscribed in a circle is going to look like.